we have two different kinds of clauses. What are they? Oh, Zachary, what's one kind of clause? Independent. Oh, yes, we have an independent clause. That's one. Oh, I'm going to write it right here. No need to hop until I ask my question. I know you would like to answer. Independent clause. And how do we know we have an independent clause? What tells us? Ah, this is independent. Shay. Oh, she's the thinking girl. She is. She is Cosette. Oh, you are so correct. It can. It can what? Stand alone. It can? Stand alone. Yeah. And of course, both kinds of clauses have both a subject and a... Yes, they, uh, all clauses have both a subject and a... That is correct. What's our other kind of clause? Melissa. Ooh, yes, we have a dependent clause. And I'm going to write that right now. Dependent. And if we have a dependent clause, how do we know we have one? How do we know we have one? How can we tell that we have one? Maddie. It cannot stand alone. It cannot stand alone. It cannot. It cannot stand alone. All right, there's two more clues. Two more clues. What kind of conjunction could an independent clause have? Ooh, it's on the chart if you've forgotten. If you've forgotten, you can always review by looking at our conjunctions chart and our clause chart. Our clause chart is right there and it tells us what kind of conjunction would go with each kind. Oh, we've already done that in our notebook. What kind, Zachary? Goes with which kind? Oh yes, a coordinating conjunction could be found in an independent clause, a coordinating conjunction. Tricky to hold my pencil and write. Now what kind of conjunction would be found in a dependent clause? What kind of conjunction would be found in a dependent clause? Isabella. Oh, a subordinating, let's say that. Subordinating. Ah, subordinating conjunction. And who can say our coordinating conjunctions? Who can say them? Who can say them? Maddie. Yes, he got it. Let's say them. And but for nor or so yet. And but for nor or so yet. And but for nor or so yet. And what are our subordinating conjunctions? What are they? Ooh, let's say them together.